Hi everyone, thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Tonight I am just going to show you how I'm using the Erin Condren Monthly Deluxe to do my social media planning. Currently I am just using the note pages and setting up um, my social media planner that way and then come January of 2019 I will start actually using the months that came in the planner. I hope by then I will have a really good uh, planning style that keeps me really well organized. Um, before we jump into that, check out the description below. I have links to my social media, any referral discount codes down there, including the $10 off your first purchase of Erin Condren if you use my link down there. And then I will also try to list any shops that I use stickers from. So we'll jump right into it. This is for um, October. So let me skip to the right page. And it's pretty straightforward. Here is the overall layout I've got for the monthly view. And um, I'll just kind of show each side. So I used some washi that I got at Michael's and then I used a kit from, I believe it's for a B60 in from uh, Cricut Paper Co. Their kit works really well for how I like setting up these pages. And then I've got my little social media girls here. Um, I believe they're from Cheerful Planner Girl. I'll try to link that below. And here what I do is I do my current stats for Instagram, YouTube, and Etsy. For Etsy, it's just the current sales. For YouTube, it's subscribers, and Instagram, it's followers. And then here, I like to try to put three goals each month. Um, they're specific to social media, so be it get so many followers, post so many videos, um, or something like that. And then here I've got package orders. I'm gonna just write out the orders that I get and list them here um, of items that need to be packaged. And then I did leave myself some more space over here if I wanna continue that, if I get more orders than um, this spot allows. Then down here I've got PR post and I will write out any of the PR posts that I do for Megan Renee Plan since she is the only shop I am PRing for right now. And then right here, I've got new releases. I will write out any items I want to release onto my Etsy this month. Do a little bit of a close up of those in case you couldn't see them. And I did lay out my paydays and I've only got one bill due. Um, that's my Etsy fee. And then there is a cute little spiderweb box just to kind of take up that empty spot. And then here, this is just kind of a washi strip. I've got a little to-do box. And then of course I noted Halloween. And then, um, like I said, this is an empty spot for whatever I feel I need to put in there. If I apply for any other shops to PR for them, I will write them in right here. And then over here, I've got Facebook, Pinterest and um, shop sales. What I do is I like to write out certain things I would like to post in my Facebook group as well as certain items I would like to share on Pinterest and then over here any sales I decide to do this month. And then the next page is just my filming list. Um, what I do is I write out everything that I am going to film and then I check off whether I filmed it, uploaded it, put the um, tags in it, edited it, and whether it's been posted. And so each month um, at the top of my list will be my plan with me for the first half of the month, my plan with me for the second half of the month, um, my monthly plan with me, and then my social media planner. So, and then again, I just used some washi, and then I left this section down here. Sometimes I like to use this to write ideas in. Um, let's see if I can show you. Um, for September, I used it for design stickers and ideas of videos I wanted to do. So um, I figured I would just give myself the option. I can use this however I need to. And that's all that I've got. So um, it's pretty straightforward. It's very simple. And so far, it's working really well for me. So come January, I think I have a pretty good idea of how I will use those note pages to work most effectively for me. So anyways, that's all I got. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye.